Hey, what's going on? My name is Mario D. Juice from MarioDJuice.com. Also, Let's Talk Podcast. Be sure to join our email newsletter, which is a newsletter where we put out emails every month to be up to date with everything of this YouTube channel and also the podcast, myself included. It's the best way to keep in touch with me. Also, be up to date with everything of the podcast and also this YouTube channel and you're all set. So yeah, definitely check out the website. I'll leave the link down below in the box to do that and let's talk. So um, you pretty much read the title. You know what I want to get into. Um, I, it's it's kind of like the same topics, but this one to me is a little different because I do want to spend time talking about, you know, this, um, this, this incredible um, feature, I'll say. Um, <clears throat> yeah, feature of a lot of, brands or companies adding pockets to leggings or sometimes they call them compartments. I very much believe this is by far one of the best inventions since sliced bread. <laughs> and let's talk about this. So um, I've been wearing tights for 10 plus years now as a runner, um, someone who's really into fitness. I exercise pretty much every day, if not every day, every other day, I'm always working out. Um, I'm 38 years old. I'm pretty fit. I'm six feet tall. I weigh almost 200 pounds. I'm like around 193 and five between that is where I'm usually that that's how much I weigh usually. So um, yeah, I'm pretty active. I live here in South Florida and I love working out, especially outside. That's really my thing. I'm, I'm more of an outdoor, you know, working out type of person besides indoor. But, but anyway, uh, this um, video is going to be about, you know, again, how a lot of brands are very much adding. Finally, they're adding compartments onto their products, their leggings or tights, compression pants. Long time ago, 10 years ago, this wasn't really a thing. And if it was, I wasn't really maybe aware of it. But a lot of pants that I purchased from like brands such as Old Navy, and I'm not being sponsored to talk about this. No one's paid to, to talk about this, you know, these products. There's no, uh, there's nothing like that, but there may be some affiliate links in the box below, but that's about it. Um, but yeah, no one's paid me to talk about this, but um, at, at some point, um, I own, I, I used to shop at Old Navy. At that time, they used to actually um, make leggings for men. I have like three pairs right now. I don't have it with me. I wish I did, but if you watch some of my videos, they're like green leggings. They're like neon green leggings and a black one. But the whole point is Old Navy used to actually make leggings for men like close to almost 10 years ago, something like that. And I still have the pairs and I, I wish I can. God, I'm not prepared. I'm so sorry about that. But all the pants besides one has compartments, but the pockets were very little. They were not really made for, you know, right now, smartphones are basically essential to everyone's life nowadays. Like everyone has a smartphone on them. 10 years ago, it wasn't like that. It wasn't really, you know, about having smartphones, but people had phones on them, obviously. But today it's like really the phone is essential. So the pockets back then on leggings were not really designed for smartphones or something a little bigger. It was mainly for like, your house keys and that's about it they're like really tiny little pockets or compartments right so the 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 out of the, the three pants two of them had no compartments they're just nothing i mean you want to talk about inconvenient major major inconvenience that's what the pants were right so i still got them because they look cool and again you i've never really seen brands design you know leggings or tights for men how old navy used to do it like these these pants look so cool like the colors i mean the, the design is sick especially when one of them are like black and neon green really cool design and i had to get them but the only con about the pants where they don't have pockets and at that time i was carrying a smartphone on me to track my runs using the nike running app but um, yeah, they didn't. They had no compartments. I mean, you want to talk about just super inconvenient? That's what they were. So I had to purchase other accessories, you know, such as like uh those 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 arm things, those arm sport things. You put your phone in, and it just kind of holds it right here on your arm. So I had one of those, and they were they were they were cool. They were not my favorite, but I needed something to carry 
my phone so I could be hands free, right? <sighs> yeah, so, they're, so back then they were, they were pretty, I mean, again, brands were not really making pants with pockets. It's, it's whatever. But again, one of them did have compartments, but really small compartments, and that's about it. But today, fast forward 2023, okay, <laughs> like it's like common. It's almost like it's like mandatory because I just I just can't see myself buying tights without compartments in them. Like I need that. It's it's it, it just makes sense. It's so convenient to have those features on the pants. I I just cannot, you know, really in today's world purchase pants like I were buying them twenty like 10, 10 years ago without any you know pockets. But today it's it's just so it's just different. I'm glad it's becoming not only a trend, but like it's it's like standard basically. Like the pants must have pockets because people have their smartphones on them every single day. It makes sense. Even shorts, like you know, I I never really ran with short tights before. Now I do because they're my favorites, and I live here in South Florida, like I said before, and it's hot down here. So wearing shorts when you're working out, it makes sense. But you know, even shorts. Well, I I really can't say they didn't have compartments, but I'll just say this: even back then, you know, brands were not making short tights for men either. They just it wasn't a thing. It just was not. And if you did find it, um, well, I'm not. I really can't talk about that. I really haven't seen any short tights back then. Nor nor was I looking for them. I was really into look like the the long tight pants, right? Like like the like the long pants <laughs> that makes any sense not shorts but yeah so today it's really different and i'm glad it's it's now standard the pants must have pockets in them it just makes sense i i cannot express to you how having like just just hands free and, and not having to worry about carrying something else like like buying other accessories like the, the arm sport thing or i even have like a, a belt fanny pack style type of you know thing where i can keep other essentials in whatever car keys um headbutt chargers um of course a smartphone maybe credit cards or whatnot <laughs> like i don't have to buy these anymore and that's that's really what i wanted to talk about so if you're looking if you're if you're watching the video because of maybe you're looking for tights with pockets um yeah you're in the right video because um they're, 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 it just makes sense. It makes so much sense. Maybe you're 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 looking for, I guess, you know, opinions on which which brand has the best tights with pockets. One of my favorites right now is pretty much any brand that has short tights. I mean, I'm just into wearing short tights now, and they all come with pockets. So really, you can go on Amazon right now, and you can find a like this this arsenal of tights short tights or even long you know pants with, with with compartments but yeah it's it's really it's really easy to find these nowadays on amazon if you want i do have a link down below where i have where i got my short pants and also long pants with pockets so again there there is affiliate links down below in this video for your convenience to learn more about these pants you don't have to obviously but but for for, for your convenience there is a link down below to learn more about them. And if you do purchase the products from the link that you know I provided, I do receive commission for that. But once again, you don't have to do this, but just for your convenience, that's there in the box below. So I very much uh, want to do a video soon about um, high-end leggings for men because I'm learning Gucci. <laughs> I'm learning that Gucci makes leggings for men. I had no idea. I don't. I don't shop at that store like that. Um, I'm not. I'm, I'm not. I'm not against wearing Gucci, you know, clothing. But it's like, you know, um, I just had no idea they were making tights for men. That's really interesting because I I want to see them now. So that'd be kind of cool. I do understand that Lulu Lululemon also makes tights for men, and um, that's interesting also. So I have to do some more research on that and what they look like and are they something. You know, it's, is it worth the money? Because they're really expensive. Like Lululemon is like known for having expensive clothing, but maybe the engineering, the fabric, the material is what's making them 
so expensive because they can maybe last longer. They don't rip up that easily. Maybe when you wash them, they don't, you know, start to you know, get get ruined. I don't know. So I have to do some research on that as well because, again, Lululemon <laughs> has some really expensive products. But Gucci, wow, like that that's that's interesting i mean i guess the question to you is do you own a pair of gucci leggings as a as a as a male or female whatever you know um do you own a pair do you have you compared the 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 material the engineering the features with cheaper you know leggings from places like amazon like do you see a difference with the material is it is it is it better is it like is it the same you know, why is it so expensive? Like, do you really see a difference in the material or whatever, like the feel of it, the functionality? That'd be kind of cool. Uh, do you also own a pair of Lululemon tights? You know, do you also see a, a difference with the material and the, just, just the build quality compared to a cheaper pair of pants that you purchase from whatever? I don't know. Walmart, Amazon. I don't know. But that'd be, that'd be kind of cool to kind of, you know, um, check out. But yeah anyway um uh, thanks for watching this video much love to you hope you got some value from it again link down below for more information um definitely become a member of the newsletter like i said before you can go on the website um ari com. the link is down below everything is, there, is down below for you for more information so um definitely make your way down there to um gain some more um, knowledge about everything else that's going on with this podcast and youtube channel and myself included. But be safe out there. Much love to you. Catch you on the next video. And thanks for watching. Peace.